Renee knew I had affairs. She was not happy about it. She had some, none, not to the degree that I had. And so I suppose there was an unspoken uh, like relationship, or we thought we had this modern relationship where if the affair existed outside there and it didn't come back and haunt us, then it was all right. We kept a distance on it. And also, the other thing was that we were both so into riding on the magic carpet of my celebrity that we just we didn't look at the underbelly of the relationship for a lot of time. Things were rolling so fast. Now, um, so Kathy, was, that was breaking the boundaries because I was never supposed to have one in New York City, but I had met Kathy on the road and she moved to New York. She moved to Thomas Street in downtown Manhattan. Now, the odd thing about that was I grew up near Thomas Street in Barrington, Rhode Island, but I didn't have a girlfriend when I was 16 because I dated my mom until I was 23. <laughs> so to some extent, I think I was going back to that. And I'm not saying I was having an affair with the street. I'm saying that people were becoming like signifiers to me. It was like I was in a movie and I didn't know whose film it was and I was going through the motions and, and it was feeling good but confusing and I was approaching 52 and things were really getting complicated. Renee wanted to get married again. Uh, again, I mean, we'd never been married, but she was pushing for it again. And I thought, I should be able to give her that gift Have we've been together so many years. And if I got married, that would automatically end the affair. But I was so timid about it, I, I, I had to propose to her in front of my therapist. <laughs> who knew I was having an affair with Kathy and said nothing about it. In fact, I brought Kathy in to meet him. And we had a session, and afterwards she went to use his bathroom, and he said, uh, she's quite European in her attitudes. She's like a French woman. I said, well, you dog, you want to fuck her, don't you? <laughs> and he said, no, no. And then he had a very bad countertransference and died of a heart attack before I could kill him. 